now see how can we solve this kind of question in this we have to solve this expression by using 8 is to 1 max so we are how many variables we are having four variables four variables means a b c d but for 8 is to 1 how many are the select line we are having only three select line right three select line for 8 is to 1 as you know that 2 raised to power 3 is equal to 8 so we are having three select line so three select line we can take it as a b and c as a select line okay and d will be mapped as a input d will be mapped as a input because as you know in 8 is to 1 we are having only three select line right so what about d like another so we'll mark d as a input now we have to apply some tricks to for uh, mapping d as a input first of all we have to draw the truth table for four variables okay as you know if we are having four variables four variables means like we are having what a b c d okay and output will be represented by y for four variables how many are the possible conditions 16 right so we'll start with the 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 and 16 right so uh, i told you for 16 possible condition how many are the 0 8 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 uh, 0 to 7 would be 8 then 1 1 8 1 okay like that after that we are having four zeros and then we are having four one then four zero then we are having four one okay then next we are having two zero two one two one two zero like that will complete then next we are having zero one zero one zero one zero one zero one and then will so complete it okay now output will be according to what as what are the numbers 1 3 4 11 so whatever the numbers we are having so at 1 we are having 1 so at 1 will marked here 1 okay next number is 3 so here 3 is there so here will mark 1 okay next number is 4 and 11 so at 4 will mark here 1 and 11 will mark here 1 okay then 12 13 14 15 as they have mentioned so whatever the numbers are present in the output will marked as a 1 and rest of the numbers are denoted by 0 okay rest of the number are denoted by 0 like so on you can uh, complete the table now what we need to do we know that we are having 8 is to 1 multiplexer for that we are having three select lines right so we can draw the 8 is to 1 multiplexer this is the 8 is to 1 multiplexer and in 8 is to 1 multiplexer we are having how many inputs 8 that start from the d naught d1 d2 it goes to d7 okay and how many are the select line i told you let us take a b c as the select line you can take d also like b c d a c d you can take any three as a select line okay so i am taking a b c as a select line and output would be y clear any doubt up to here now what we in the next step what we need to do we need to draw a table okay like which table as you know that how many are the input d naught d1 d2 d3 d4 d5 and d6 so we'll mark the these input here okay like we'll mark d naught like this d1 then d2 then d3 then d4 then d5 then d6 and then d7 okay now uh, this this d is different okay that d is for the data and this d is for the variable now what we need to do we need to do uh, do d will be marked mapped as a input so d is a single term right d is a single term it can be one or it can be zero 
yes if it will be 1 then we'll mark it as a d if it will be 0 then we'll mark it, a, it as a d bar okay then we'll mark it as a d bar so in this case either it would be d bar i told you draw a line either it would be d okay d bar for the 0 and d for the 1 right this uh, these are the variables we we are using as a input d is the variable here and we are using it as a input okay clear so as you can see that d not like d bar d bar is 0 right so what we'll get here 0 so mark it as a 0 only okay then uh, then after that d bar here right 0 d bar here is 0 so what is the number here that is 2 okay mark it as 2 then after that 4 then similarly 6 8 10 12 and 14 okay similarly we'll see for the d as you know the d is 1 1 is here on the 1 again 1 is here on the 3 so we'll mark 1 3 5 7 9 11 13 14 okay sorry 15 okay so where we are having number d bar means 0 it is on 0 so we'll mark it as 0 then 2 then 4 then 6 d is a number which is represented by 1 it is on the 1 number it is on the 3 number it is on the 5 number so we'll mark it here okay now what we need to do we have 1 3 4 11 so whatever numbers they have mentioned we have to circle it like this 1 is there 3 is there 4 is there okay 11 is there 13 is there 12 is there 14 is there and we are having 15 also okay any doubt up to here so we'll mark the circle like this okay in the next step what we need to do we need to add it add it means like we are having a uh, one on the circle and one one will be in the d so we should write d here okay why other numbers are not circled because we have to see the question in the question they said 1 3 4 11 so whatever numbers are the mentioned in the question will circle only those numbers okay now next one is the again 3 is on the d so we'll write down d here 4 is on the d bar so we'll write down d bar here okay as you can see that there is no circle so we'll write down 0 no circle we'll write down 0 circle on d so we'll write down d okay circle on both it means d plus d bar i, I told you d plus d bar is equal to 1 remember the boolean expression in this also we are having two circle that would be one okay clear now what we need to do we have to see that k map see d naught is connected with d so i'll do d naught is uh, mark one line with the d okay mark another line with the d bar mark one line with the one mark one line with the zero okay as you can see that d naught is connected with d so connect d naught with the d okay next d1 with the d so connect d1 sorry d1 with the d again then d2 with the d bar then d2 with the d bar okay d bar then d3 with 0 then d3 with 0 okay then d4 with the 0 then d4 with the 0 okay then d5 d6 d7 d6 d7 are connected with 1 and d5 is connected with uh, no d5 is connected with d right so d5 is connected with the uh, yeah d5 is connected with the d okay clear clear this thing so this is your the final expression here you can see we are having only three select line 
right so a b c will take it as a select line and d will mark it as a input okay so this is how we can solve the four variable with the three select line we have to convert in this question you can take a as a input also then in that case you will take b c d as a select line okay that depends on you but take it like a b c it is in the sequence take it this one as a select line that will be more convenient to you and last one would be input okay